my boss says we're going to grade our OKRs at the end of the quarter next month. And it's apparently Jim's first grading. He says, I'm a bit lost and I don't know what to expect and I don't want to look dumb. Can you give me more information on grading? I know it has something to do with colors. (laughs) (laughs) Yes. Yes, that's a great question. Okay, so absolutely. First thing, don't panic. I think people hear grading and all of a sudden they're back in elementary school and they're freaking out. So don't get nervous. Like this process, process, like one when done correctly, it should be casual and quick and and friendly, you know? Okay. So there are a couple of different ways to do this, but when I'm guiding our team through grading our OKRs, I like to do a spotlight system. So green means you hit the goal. Yellow means you hit some of the goal, but not completely. And red means you did not hit the goal. So it's very, very simple. So the process should be, okay, we go to this KR and you say it was, it's green, it's red, or it's yellow. Uh, so, and since KRs are numerically measurable, you should be able to figure out what color you're at pretty quickly. Um, so we, and when we grade our OKRs, we try not to really dwell on the why or try to explain anything during that process. It should be pretty quick and easy. What color is a KR? Yellow, great, moving on. So don't look at your OKR grading as a performance review. It's more of a check-in, like how do we do on that? Goal?